All right, so what's up, YouTube? What's up, Future Cliff? All right, so today I'm going to talk about my experience at the gym last night. Last night, it was June 21st, 2017, and I'm just very excited right now, you know? So I would ask you guys to please bear with me because this is very exciting news for me. And um, this is a commentary, and I don't know how I'm going to do this the right way. Um, it doesn't take a lot of time and focus and energy to do this the right way. I'm going to try to wing it and try to make it as best as possible. So I was at home, and I was feeling bloated, and I didn't want to go to the gym. Well, I didn't not didn't want to go to the gym. I just didn't want to do legs. But the next thing on my list was legs, and I needed to do it. So I was going to wait till Thursday. So... Wednesday night, felt bloated, got everything out of my system, and it still felt bloated, but I mean, I just needed to hit the gym. I hit up my friend, Nick, to hit the gym with me, and we took off. Met up with him at the gym, and we started do it, uh, doing lunges. After lunges, I saw the squat rack open, and uh, I went for the squat rack. Understandable. So... As we are squatting, as you can see, I was doing my regular squats. You know, I usually pick up the bar, I take it out of the squat rack, and then I start squatting. I do not need the bar. I do not want the bar there. I am very, very comfortable with my ability to do squats without the bar. All right. Nick, he is not used to squatting. So we did... A little bit of squatting before I made him put the bar on his back because one thing about me I rather have my buddy and anybody do proper form other than more weights because if you don't have great form you're going to fuck something up and I've been hurt before and I don't want to be hurt ever again all right so I am not going to try to hurt my friend or anyone else period I would never so after he did that we did a couple more but you know we're not going to film every single thing that we did. So he picked up the camera when he was able to after he did his unweighted squats. And he just did his thing while I did mine. He put up the camera and recorded me doing what I'm doing. I am not very good at counting weights. So that's that. <laughs> and uh, we're just going to go through all these clips because of my exciting news. I really want to show to the world and tell the world. So... I started putting it on my belt, and I was going for like a caddy, a 25, and a 10 on each side. So, I really don't need the belt until I get to two caddies, but I wasn't... You, you ever know when you feel like doing something, and then when it's about to happen, you get like nervous, or you're not feeling it anymore? It's, it's a very strange feeling, and that's what I felt when I was at the gym. You know, I wanted to go in there and kill legs, kill legs with heavy, heavy volume. Got to the gym, did one squat. I was like, oh shit, today is not the day. So I put on the belt very early and I did what I had to do. You know, I killed a couple squats and got my stretching, you know. Two caddies is just something I just dream of just doing very very easy i shouldn't i've been in the gym for a little bit and i understand it takes time for certain things but at the same time me doing one caddy to stretch and to get the feeling is not good enough i hate that i hate it i hate it so i always dreamt of just doing two caddies very very easy i don't know what was in me but last night in this clip right here I took two caddies on each side out of the squat rack for the first time ever and I started squatting it like it was nothing. I've never done this before. I don't know what got into me. I could have dropped the weight at any time, you know. I even took a little pause and before uh, I went down because I was thinking, should I do one more or two more? Once I went down for the fourth set, I mean the fourth rep, and I came back up, I, I had to like rack it because I knew I wouldn't have got another one. And you can just see the excitement on my face. Like I was just excited. 
very, very excited for what I did. You know, so after that, we did leg press just a little bit. You know, um, one thing about me, I don't like people going to the gym, talking. It's, it's, it's very, you know, you're not, you're not putting in work. You're too busy talking and it's gossiping and all that. I really don't like that. But it's something that me and Nick ended up doing. Um, we got cold, basically. We got very cold. Uh, Nick is someone who's who's trying to get into the gym. And all he wants to do is chest, chest, chest. We can't do chest 100 times every time you come in. It's, that's not how it goes. It, it will never go like that. So please bear with me. Let's do legs just for a little bit. All right, so after that, I just have a quick story to tell. Um, Nick went on the bench press machine. Well, I said bench press machine. Nick went to the bench press, and uh, I saw some guys lifting 315 deadlift. And I was like, huh, that's my limit. I'm feeling good right now. Let me ask them to try it out for a bit with no warm-up whatsoever. The guys were lifting 315. I asked to join. He said, yeah, go for it. I put the belt on. I lift 315 for four reps like it was nothing. I've never done that before in my life. I would never, never, never would have guessed I would have walked into the gym and, and uh, deadlift 315 for four times without stopping. Now, I do not have video of it because it was just like a spontaneous thing. I walked up to him and asked. He said, yeah, perfect. So, since I was feeling myself just a little bit, I ended up taking another bar from an incline machine, incline bench, and I put uh, 315 on the bar just so I could deadlift by myself because I was really feeling it. As you can see, I was able to do 315, and this this is just, I, I was able to do 315 with no hesitation, no problems, no nothing, and I just went in. Like, I don't know where it came from, but I just went in. I lift, I dropped, I lift, I drop, I lift, I drop. If you look at my form, I made sure everything was tight and good, because I I do not want to hurt myself. Today is the day after. Do my back hurts just a little bit. But I know why. Because what I'm going to tell you later will explain everything. And honestly, I know you might see a camera in my face. Well, <laughs> not you see it. But obviously, I know there's a camera in my face. And I don't act any different in front of the camera. The one thing that I might do different is be calm. But honestly, I don't care sometimes. And I don't care at all. All right. So me dancing, singing out loud, that is who I am in the gym. I'm in my element. I don't care who's looking, who cares, who wants me to be quiet. No, I'm trying to feel good. You're here for a reason, too. And I guarantee you're trying to feel good as well. So what I do is what I do. I don't want. Any oh, the craziest thing is going through my mind. I've never, ever attempted to do 405 in my life. I believe that's 405. But it's always been a dream of mine it's just to get it up. All right. It's been a dream to get it up. Now, I'm just going to cut straight to the point. Um, I tried it and it didn't work on the first try. The second try. It didn't work. The third try, uh, if I'm not mistaken, I believe there is a third try. Um, it, it, it didn't get up. But one thing I can say um, when I was when I already told myself, you know what, I'm not gonna do it anymore. I'm done. Some guy saw me struggling, and he's like, "Yo, yo, 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 yo! I know you're not gonna just not try again." I'm like, "Yeah, cause I'm I'm biting off more than I can chew. I never practiced this, you know. I don't practice this. Today was just a day I'm feeling good, and I I'm biting off more than I can chew." And he's like, no, nah, man, I know you got this. I know you got this. Let me try it real quick. So the guy tried it, and he does it in sumo position. If you know anything about sumo position, he opens his legs completely wide just to lift the bar off the ground. Now, there's two ways of doing it, conventional, which is what I do, and sumo, which is what he does. Honestly, sumo is pretty hard for me. 
but it's kind of weird because you, you have to get used to it of opening your legs and you're using you're using a different type of muscle just to lift up the bar, not just um your calf and all that. You're using more quad you're using quad strength, you're using your lateral medius, you're using vascular lateral medius, like you're using all these things just to lift it up. So it's very, very different and very, very strange for me to even try. I don't deserve it. I didn't work for it. <laughs> All right, your turn, Nick. I'll beat you up if you try that. You, you're not ready. Oh, yeah, there you go. That's your turn. Once the guy lifts up the bar and he dropped it, I was like, no way. I can't let this guy lift up the bar just like that, you know, and then tell me, hey, man, you still got it. And then he walks away. I'm like, no, this is my baby. This is my bar. This is my 405. All right. So like every fairy tale that has a happy ending. I try to lift 405 off the ground. After that dude showed me this is my first attempt. I turn on the camera knowing that if I turn on the camera and I don't lift it, that's a problem. But I turn on the camera, I was pumped and I lifted 405 off the ground, my fourth attempt. And I dropped it. And I didn't go for it again. I was very excited. The guy in the upper left-hand corner of the screen looked at me. And he said, hey, because he was with the other guy who told me I can do it. And he was proud. He gave me a thumbs up. The other guy was is right there in the far left corner too in the gray. He saw me. I gave him thumbs up. And it was great. Oh, my God. They saw it. And I did it. Like it was a piece of cake, you know. I drank water again. I came back to the bar and then I tried to lift the bar once more and I wasn't able to. That's okay. I was able to get it up once and I'm okay with that. I could have left the gym not lifting 405, but I continued to try and I did it. Now I have a new PR and I'm very proud of myself. Thank you.